An Oak Bay senior is recovering from injuries that he sustained during a traffic stop. As CTV first reported, a dispute with police left him bloodied and bruised. And today, the feisty senior has filed a complaint. Victoria Bureau Chief Jim Beatty has the story. They are gruesome, painful injuries. These are Arthur Pegler's hands after being stopped for a routine traffic violation. Arthur Pegler is 87. They didn't break any, any bones, but veins, skin, and tissues uh, shredded. All this stemming from a seatbelt infraction in Quiet Oak Bay. The integrated road safety unit stopped him, but witnesses say shouting soon ensued and handcuffs were slapped on his wrists. He had a trick of twisting the manacle, which injured both hands, and then lifting my arms up behind my back. Today, police launched an investigation into what happened following a witness complaint. They won't say much, but they have said the octogenarian poked and grabbed officers before the handcuffs came out. Uh, two of our officers were assaulted during a traffic stop. The person responsible was taken into custody and was released later on a court document to appear in court at a later date. Solicitor General John Less is also demanding answers and he's asked for a full report. But clearly it, it's worth looking into because, uh, as I said, on the surface, uh, there are some questions that I think need to be answered. Witnesses questioned whether handcuffs were necessary on an 87-year-old man, but said he was agitated. He was thrashing about a fair amount. Um, they were trying to restrain him. There was a, an awful lot of blood on the street. Pegler calls it a nightmare. He needed reconstructive surgery to his wounds. What would you like to see happen? I'd like to see absolutely nothing happen. Forget the whole damn thing and let the police sort out their own disciplines. But that's not going to happen. Pegler now faces the prospect of criminal charges. Jim Beatty, CTV News, Victoria.